<laughs> really, this doesn't bother me. Any adorable looks just like daddy. Can I join in on the Stanley Cup craze? Lots of gold in your future. Hello, hello everyone. It is officially spooky season for me, which means we are going to be heading to the Spirit Halloween store. Ooh, welcome to the carnival. <laughs> what does this little guy do? Step. <laughs> oh. Okay. Oh my gosh. It's the rat that killed Karnak. <laughs> Sorry, ride the cyclone reference. Ooh. Got a little spinny wheel thing. Oh yeah. Let me see. Did I spin it too hard? Mm, I don't know how hard you meant to spin it. It's still going. I was a little uh, too harsh. Going. <laughs> star? Really? <laughs> you waited all that time and then had to slow it down for it to land on star. I will never escape this, will I? <laughs> you won't. <laughs> Pumpkin! Is it gonna work? Oh, he's not working. Oh! Never mind. I was walking away too soon. Whoa. Giant death ray. And he lights up. That's so cool. What's he doing? Yeah, I don't think it does anything. Oh, it's just... Yeah. Uh... <laughs> That's adorable. Can I keep him? <laughs> you found a friend? <laughs> You know it's his 80th anniversary next year? What? Yeah. The Casper, Car the Casper cartoon started in 1945. Holy cow! Yeah. <gasps> okay. <laughs> Got the clowns over here. We have art. We have the ice cream truck from Killer Clowns from Outer Space. We have Pennywise, the dancing clown. Oh wait, I gotta do the thing that he does in the movie. <laughs> Oh my gosh, they have a Georgie costume for the dog. Spongebob. If this fits my cat because they're big enough, I'm totally getting the cat Spongebob. Oh jeez! Oh my... Okay. Wow. Huh? I guess that's all it does. Just be gross. Uh, it's triggering my trypophobia. Uh. I just realized that clown up there is nodding its head back and forth, or side to side. I don't know. It's it's doing something. But I want to go in here because there's like a little. They made a fun house of terror thing. Let's see what's inside. Oh, there's me. Ooh. Okay, well, that that gave me body dysmorphia real bad. Oh, ooh, trypophobia with the eyeballs. Oh, it's the Reaper. Oh, and it's trying to catch my face. Hold on, I'm gonna stand to the side so you guys can see that better. Oh, oh, these are like their original characters. Oh, sh oh, that's not nice. Hey, man. Oh, oh, it's a smile he carved. That's okay, never mind. That's nice. I take it back. Okay, thank you. Oh, oh, hello. Who's this? How many? Oh, it's the crawler thing. Oh. Ah. Cool. Okay. Freakish. Oh my oh. god. <laughs> Jesus. God. Okay. 
Oh, this is our favorite because we grew up with him. Ugh, I hate this part though because it's like, it's the Reaper. Scared Halloween Reaper himself. Yep. You got your blood everywhere and the dysmorphia mirrors. That's great. Okay. Yeah. It's a bear. Balancing on the ball. Look at the bear! Joseph! It's so cute! I want this! Aww. I was gonna say it's like a cocaine bear. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, I didn't mean it. Uh, you're a very talented bear, Barnaby the bear, for 280 bucks. No, his name is Barnaby. Can I join in on the Stanley Cup craze? Is this this is gonna get me a part of that? This is so cool. It's crazy. That is cool. It's so cool. They have one of uh, Ark the Clown from Terrifier. Yeah. Jason Patrick's gonna be in the next one, so I'm excited. <laughs> I, I don't know. Is he gonna be a good guy, a bad guy? I haven't even seen the the. I've seen the first one. I haven't seen like the second one. Is there a third one? Or is, uh, is there I'm not. Third I've one? only seen the first one. Yeah, it's a lot of blood, but yeah. You know, if you're squeamish, then probably not for you. But I, uh, I was trying to go into healthcare at one point, so I can kind of handle it. <laughs> <laughs> These are like those oversized hoodie blanket things. They have one of Beetlejuice. Looks like that. They have a Freddy Krueger one. I have one that has sushi all over it, but you said you wanted one. Yeah, I was realizing that it's the same thing. Yeah. She gets you the Beetlejuice one because Freddy Krueger is kind of gross. A little bit. Eh. I could snuggle with Elvira. I need this. <laughs> you and every male. <laughs> I feel like if there was a pillow, she doesn't really sing. They look soft enough to be like. <laughs> I'd love to meet Elvira. So there's a Twilight one. Uh -oh. Sorry. <laughs> Teenager phase just came out big time. Silence of the Lambs. It's horror. It's, whoa! Look at the greeting mats. Oh yeah. There's good guys, Chucky. There's the haunted mansion. Welcome, foolish mortals. There's Halloween with the Halloween duh. You know, with like Michael Myers. There's the Beetlejuice ghost house. I like the Mars attack stuff. It's so random. Yeah. I mean, of course, my favorite has to be. Of course. And it's so bright and colorful. This one's actually pretty cool because it's the. Yeah, that does look cool. It looks like the sewer grate. Yeah. And ghost faces up here. Nice. I don't need any more mugs. I don't need any more mugs, but I kind of want this one. Especially the bride down there, but all the universal monsters. Why is there like a bite taken out of it though? That's interesting. I don't know if that's like supposed to be there. Okay, it's not supposed to be there. <laughs> that's funny. These are so cool. Got your Dungeons and Dragons, Stitch for some reason. Got Wednesday. We got the Sanderson sisters' house. Oh my gosh, Corpse Bride, and it's the ring as the handle. Cute. I don't know if you can see that because there's a one heck of a glare. It's they're, they're playing the song. I feel like a monster. By the way, I'm like, oh hi, high school Varsha. Would have loved this. <laughs> Fiona and um, listen, I love wearing chokers, but that's oh, it's like a locket thing. Oh, see, it like has a hinge so it opens. Oh, okay, interesting. Okay, <laughs> get your Shrek on, I guess. <laughs> that's cool though. Oh my god, instead of wearing like the Disney princess tiaras, I could wear the Fiona one or the ogre ears. I want to go back to Universal Studios. I mean, we are. Yeah. For Horror Nights. But, like, 
the one in Florida too, because I haven't experienced that Horror Nights, which would be super fun. Someday, one day. That is terrifying. Why <laughs> is that there? That's, that's making me irrationally angry. That's how you get PTSD from the minions. Does anyone want to go as the Matterhorn Yeti? Actually, this looks scarier. Yikes. But creepy. just to uh, paint the eyes red and go like, Rawr, and then and then there you go, Matterhorn yeah. Yeti. Also, there's like a bunch of innuendos on these shirts, which uh, if you can see them, y you know what they're saying. If you don't know what they're saying, I don't want to explain it because you might be too young. <laughs> Oh my gosh. They have Barney. It's the inflatable costumes. They have Barney. I see Barney. It's my childhood. Of course, he's right with all the other inflatable dinosaurs and chickens. Generic dinosaur. Well, I mean, I guess this is evolution showing itself right here with the... Yeah, I was kind of thinking that. I want... I mean, I don't want to dress as Barney because I feel like that's going to be hard to walk around in, but... This Boy, is so cool. Nope. What? Nope. Oh, yeah, the wacky and guy. the wacky arms and wait, no, wavy, wavy arms, arms and, and guy, guy inflatable. inflatable. I, okay, that was harder than it needed to be. <laughs> or you can go you as left a shark. Cow, go as a cow. I gotta go, shark? Julia. We got cows. <laughs> I gotta go, Julia. We got cows. Ren fair season's coming up, and here's all this cool stuff, like pirate garb. I don't want to go as a pirate for Ren Faire, but I don't know. I'm still figuring out what I'm going to wear. I don't know what I'm going to wear yet. I'm yeah. trying not to wear what I've already worn. I mean, it doesn't matter, but like, I want to, I want to have like a character to go as. Yeah. Or like a character that I've created. Because I just kind of like show up and I'm like, yeah, dress. But, I don't know, I kind of want to go as like a cool pirate or something. I'm obsessed with like the onesie costumes that they have, or they're calling it jumpsuits, but they're just so comfy. Like for Oogie Boogie Bash, I'm going to be wearing a onesie type costume, but now I'm like seeing Mike Wazowski and Sully and I'm like, that would have been cute for us to go as- Oh my god, that is still terrifying. Why? <laughs> Ugh. No matter where you go, he's just staring. I know. He's always watching. I know. Always, always watching. watching. I'm watching you, Wazowski. Always watching. Ooh, she's nuts. Oh. You should have gone as Roz then. Here's your Barbie section. Oh, and Pooh! And Garfield. That's so funny. Oh my gosh, the Eeyore onesie's so oh. cute! And then Tigger and Pooh. We could have done like ah! Eeyore and Tigger. It would have been so cute. I Very love the Toy onesie. Story. I know, but like... <laughs> Yeah, my my costume for Oogie Boogie is like themed to what villains are gonna be there. So, yeah, I like the Sesame Street ones too. Like, <gasps> whoa, hold on, this is cool. Okay, I might need this, but they don't have. Oh, they do. There's a medium, but I'm also tall, so I like to get baggy. This that is kind of unsettling. Giant. Scooby head. Okay. I like the purse though. Scooby snacks. Oh, this is so cool. I'm loving the love for Scooby Doo recently. Like, there's so much more stuff. This is, ooh, a mystery machine. I guess you can cosplay as the mystery machine. The Scooby Doo onesie. So cute. This is healing my 90s heart. You got Hercules and Megara. Also, Tinkerbell. I love Tinkerbell. <gasps> The Powerpuff Girls, what? except I only see Blossom. Oh yeah, with it's, Bubbles and Buttercup. <gasps> no, oh, there's it's just Buttercup. Buttercup. And then Kim Possible. Oop, oh. I just knocked over Eeyore, my bad. Huh, I got the Incredibles, Elastigirl, Peter Pan, Cinderella, who I thought was Wendy, but that's Wendy. And Cruella de Vil, but it's only the, this thing. It's cool. Uh, if you guys didn't know that Hades is actually going to be at Oogie Boogie Bash this year, so if you want to be Hercules, oh my god, there's an Ursula dress. That's kind of cute. But it'd be kind of cute to see a couple dress up as Hercules and Megara, or Pain and Panic. Okay. That'd be cute if somebody dressed up as Pain and Panic. Oh, Squid Game. That's a Squid Game. Yeah. So, oh, Squid Game. 
More Squid Game. <laughs> okay. <gasps> oh my God, X Men '97 costumes. Oh, Gambit. Oh my God, but I, I got excited with Storm. Yeah. Oh, and Gremlins. But Storm. That's cool. I'd actually want to dress up as Rogue. I don't know. She's cool. I like Rogue. That'd be a cool costume. Yeah. You should go as Gambit. I could see that. I feel like I could do that. <laughs> I'd probably throw a better costume together than that. But the Batman costume, uh. actually, I'm surprised. Their Batman costumes look better than they usually do. Usually their Batman costumes look pretty cheapy. I mean, it's how you style it, too. Like, yeah. you can make a cheap costume look good by just styling it. So... These are cool. And of course, you got the Harley Quinn that every girl was in 2016. It was yeah. actually kind of cute. My little sister was Harley Quinn. She had never seen the movie, though, so... I gotta ask, who wore it better? <laughs> this. I think Cousin It always takes the winner for that, though. Although, he needs to be fully covered in hair. It can't just be, like... On your head. Yeah, that's not the you same. You gotta commit to it. You gotta get like at least five of these and just deck yourself out with hair. Cousin It doesn't have arms, at least not that we can see. He's just hair. Yeah. This is cute. This is the Tim Curry Pennywise. If anybody grew up and saw that around the same time that I grew up, which was like 1990 or 1991? It came out in 90. Okay. The year you were born. Yeah. But they would play it every so often on TV, and I just happened to catch it, and that's where my fear of clowns began. But now I'm over it, so... Hey. <laughs> over it. Uh... I, uh, forgot to tell you guys, I have a kid. This is the father reveal. Ain't he adorable? Looks just like Daddy. <laughs> Looks just like William Shatner. <laughs> He uh, also takes after his dad. He's a little homicidal maniac, but you know, we, we put him in therapy. He'll be fine. Right, little guy? It's okay, take your time. There's the t-shirt wall. I always get sucked into this area. Oh my god. Wait, okay, I'm not really, like, Billy's great, but I am a stew mocker girl. Surprise, Sydney. I know, I shouldn't like either of them because, you know, they're killers, but but if I had to go with a guy from Scream, it's always gonna be Stu, ride or die. I, I love this though. I love the bloody disgusting shirts too. Like those are really cool. And I love the, I think his name is Steven Rhodes is the artist that does like this type of art. But I love his shirts. I have one that has Bloody Mary on it. And I have to walk away from this because I know I'm gonna grab every single thing. Oh my gosh! Wait, they have a spirit established 1983. That's cool. And if you saw my previous video about the spirit store, you know a little bit of the history about it too. That's right. <laughs> Just a little plug. Look at all the Chucky. Oh my god, it's the seed of Chucky one. There's a uh, there's Chucky, there's Tiffany, and there's Glenn. They look so adorable. That's Tiffany. I I don't know. I feel like I kind of want to be Tiffany this year for Halloween, but we'll see. I haven't figured out an official Halloween costume yet because look, we got Ghostbusters, we got Friday the 13th, we got Beetlejuice. We've got, oh, there's Tiffany back here. Ooh, that jacket is cute. I feel like I would just wear this just to wear it as like a regular outfit thing. Okay, yeah, I would totally wear this just to wear this as a regular outfit piece. But here is Halloween. Ooh, we got a sexy Michael Myers. Okay, I might want to be that. That's cute. And they got, oh, killer clowns. Oh my gosh. Oh, I guess it's just the costumes, like, I have that one, the shorty costume, but we'll see. I'm not sure yet. Freddy Krueger, I have the sweater. We'll see what I can put together without actually buying a new costume. Okay, but like, I was wondering why the shirts were like 30 bucks, because I'm like, that's kind of expensive, but they're like thick quality, and it's not just the front, it's stuff on the back. Yeah, they have like all these little fun things on the back. It's like when it, it released in theaters kind of like... Yeah, it looks like yeah, an advertisement from back then. 
<laughs> I don't need any more shirts, but gosh, and I, I don't know how I would make this work because it's like big, but like not big. It's it's short, but wide. If it was like longer, I could make it look like a dress, but I don't know. As you can see, I like my oversized shirts and no yeah. pants look. I'm wearing <laughs> shorts, by the way. Don't get scared. So what did you just explain to us about the shirt? So the shirts have the uh, horror icons on the TVs from the decades that they came out in. Like I, Michael Myers is clearly on a 70s TV. And then Scream on one of those 90s home TVs. I remember Jim having Barrymore. those. And then <laughs> that's the 80s TV for Friday the 13th. And Terrifier looks like a... Like looks early like a 2000s TV. Yeah, it looks like but... maybe late 2000s. I think it was late 2000s <laughs> that the first Terrifier came out. Or early 2010s, one of those. I thought it was like the 2010s. I think so, Maybe but that, like... that looks like a 2000s TV though. Uh. Guys, it's Freddy Fazbear. It's Freddy Fazbear. It's actually uh, the latest one. What was it? Security Breach? Or, yeah. I, yeah. Apparently they're making oh. another one. Oh my goodness. How many Five Nights at Freddy's? It, movie or game? Game. Oh. Okay, because why not? Look at all the scream ghost face masks. Like, I feel like this one speaks volumes to me. I need it, but I don't need it. But, ooh, maybe I need that one. I don't know. Maybe I'll go as ghost face this year for Halloween. I don't have to do my makeup or anything. We'll see. <laughs> Cute. Don't kill my vibes. ka Oh my gosh. I want... I mean, I feel like I would just wear this just to wear it. Like, go to Disneyland, throw this on. It looks comfortable. That'd be cute. As long as I don't see Mater. I have a horror story about Mater because I was walking and I didn't, like, there was no sound coming from behind me. All of a sudden I turn and he's directly, like, face to face with me and he goes, Howdy! This is at Disney California, by the way. Hopefully no one's like thinking that there's an actual Mater truck driving around in like the actual streets, but yeah, he like I turned around, and he goes howdy with his big eyes, and I was like ah, and I ran like 50 feet away. <laughs> it was horrible and embarrassing. All the kids started laughing. These are so cute. I actually thought this was a mask, but it's a light cover for your I guess house lights. If they don't look aesthetically pleasing, you can cover them with a pumpkin, or a cat, or a clown, or a skull. That's a cute skull. Like, it looks adorable. And then we have, of course, the cool jack-o'-lantern themed jack-o'-lanterns. I don't know why I was trying to make it more complex than it was, but that's cool. I like the witchy ones. Cute. Ooh, door covers too. I think these are fabric, so like, you can reuse them multiple times because I have the plastic ones that you just have to tape on and they get like messed up and wrinkled and ripped. But cute. So we got we got Pennywise right there. Sorry about the glare. There's Pennywise. We got Sam from Trick or Treat. The Gremlins causing chaos. Got ugh, Leatherface. One of the mazes at Horror Nights this year, by the way. Oh my God, look at Chucky, so cool got Michael Myers, we got Mars Attacks again, and then we got Art the Clown. That's cool. Oh wait, the glare, sorry. Oh my gosh. So cute. I was trying to turn it off and then jab me. Where, where do I get Chucky's? Oh, there it is. Showtime! Oh. <laughs> Ouch. These are loud. Oh, okay. Chucky, chill. There we go. And now we got Michael Myers. Where's his button? I can't find it. There it is. Oh, got his music. Got the wall of Beetlejuice. Well, what's new Scooby Deuce is playing in the background? That's funny. That's cute. Oh, oh my god, it's Binksy! I mean, Binks. Sorry, my cat's name is Binks, and I always go Binksy when I see him. Oh, oh! Oh my gosh! This one's cool. The Beetlejuice one. I love the clapboard for Nightmare on Elm Street. That's cool. 
We got all the wall art stuff here. It's all like movie memorabilia looking. If that makes sense. Oh, they have the exorcist up there. Can't really see it. In case of possession, break glass. It's holy water. Cool shining. That's so cool. Oh, we got some Pennywise, the lover. It's a loser. Overlook Hotel from The Shining. Nice. Bates Motel. Stop. It lights up. Okay, it's not working, but I, I guess it lights up. That's awesome. Wow, Annabelle's down there. Oh, I need it all, but I don't have any room, but I will have a house of horrors. Ha horrors. Sorry, I know that sounded not like what I just said, but yeah. Gosh, it's a little guy from Haunted Mansion. That's so cool. I love that they're doing Haunted Mansion decorations now. You guys, I'm obsessed with this purple kind of holographic looking decorations because they are so up my alley with the aesthetic. And then these little fortunes, like the fortune telling games that we used to play in middle school and elementary school, it's such a throwback. But the fortune telling stuff is so pretty and like this purple, I love it. I love that deep, eerie, creepy purple. Also, that dead and breakfast sign was something I wanted to take home with me, but I, again, would not know where to put it. Also, look at all the Halloween, I think Chucky doesn't belong there, but Chucky was there, but all the Michael Myers masks, just all the masks in general because, you know, nothing is more iconic than the spirit halloween mask wall except that one triggered my trypophobia and i had to like quickly pan over it because ugh, i don't know a lot of the stuff like with holes and bumps like the wall itself is fine i don't know there's just something about certain patterns that end up triggering my trypophobia and I don't understand where that stems from. But yeah, just more masks upon masks upon masks. And there's this Misfits one that I actually really wanted. Ugh, Momo. Oh my god. Momo scares the shit out of me. Okay, well, that's all you're getting of that one because I, I hate the face on it. Oh my god, it's so creepy. This uh, Leatherface one though, that was pretty cool from the classic film. And then you got Terrifier one, you got Jigsaw, or Billy the Puppet from Saw. I don't know why I messed that up because I actually enjoyed those movies. And then we have the really creepy animal face wall. I don't know, this one's very unsettling. Oh, and now we got babies because nothing is more unsettling than a bunch of zombie babies or just regular babies. Yeah, I could pan away at any time now because this is getting real disturbing. Except now we have the fake weapons. YouTube, don't get mad at me. Marsha, you just can't cut people out of your life. So it looks like the spirit reaper actually has his own decoration now. It's about time. I know, that's so cool. I love how this, this doesn't bother me. This, however, makes me really squeamish. Like, I, I can't even look at it. This is fine. This. There's nothing to me. This? I don't know why. I can't even look, I can't even look at it. You have interesting standards. I, I don't know. Marsha always getting stuck looking at the jewelry. Okay, but like, it's cute. And I wear stuff like this. Just, just to wear it. Ooh. I like this one. I hear Will Smith. Nightmare on my street. Oh yeah, off the distance. <laughs> Gosh, they have the Deadpool and Wolverine. Uh. I love Wolverine. I didn't really get into Deadpool though. Don't know why. But. Oh my gosh, they have tiny versions of the babies. I want the ghost face one. He's so cute. The Pennywise one is okay, but oh my god, look at Sam. So adorable. Okay, now when I was little, why didn't we have a mystery machine trick-or-treat basket? I would have carried that every single year. We used to get like these types, but the pumpkin like shaped ones, but they were kind of flimsy in the handle. So they would just end up snapping and yeah, breaking every that. year. So it was pillowcases every single time. <laughs> 
These are cute though. I love the tote bag with the kitty. Oh, I don't need I don't need any more tote bags, but it is my weakness. A lot of a lot of everything in here is my weakness, so. Have your fortune told. <laughs> Barely. I see lots of gold in your future. Well, that's encouraging. <laughs> Told we weren't supposed to buy anything. I was told <laughs> yes. that we weren't supposed to buy anything. But somebody. Well, I mean, some of it was for you. Okay, but well, that's different. <laughs> yeah, so I'm worth it. It's different when it's for you. <laughs> so, um, we weren't expecting to buy stuff, but yeah, like, Joseph got me a shirt. It's kitties. I was gonna get the the scare like the what is it bloody disgusting one with Scream, like the movie and Drew Barrymore's eyes, but they only had like really big sizes. I, I think I just didn't really care for like the color and the way it would fit because it was like huge, but uh, it would have been nice. But I got kitties instead. Also, Joseph surprised me with Casper that I found earlier. He's so cute. Who doesn't love Casper? I thought about maybe waiting until post-holiday clearance, but I was like, if I wait till then, he's gonna be gone. There was only like two of them there. And I know at Horror Nights, I think they have like games where you can play and win him. I think so. Yeah. We can barely play those. And it's already like 30 bucks to play a game. Yeah, so practically. <laughs> we always end up at Target after we go to like any store, but they have like Beetlejuice stuff which i mean like i know the movie's coming out but it's halloween themed <laughs> that's cool got that we have one i think that just says beetle juice on it yeah that's cool it has the green in the back that's awesome can i see one i think it's just like spider webs yeah that's cool. So we're starting to see Halloween stuff pop up at Target now. There's a coloring book, Pennywise. It. It's very complex. Like the, what is it, the adult coloring books? But that's one way to keep me busy for hours. Look. I've... I don't believe in ghosts, but I also don't believe in messing with things you don't understand. There are things in this world that we will never fully understand. Understand. Is there a resemblance? I think there is. <laughs> and, uh, she's adorable. She just needs a little beauty mark of her lip right here. <laughs> and then, it's me. <laughs> I never like saw dolls growing up that kind of looked like me, so now that I'm seeing him, I'm like, missed out. Like, my childhood is coming back. Yeah. It's crazy. Bart. I'm like the Bart Simpson of my family. This is why I'm like, I think I need this. <laughs> I don't, but... I'm Bart Simpson. Who the hell are you? 